Hi everyone, I'm Melissa. I'm a librarian at Bayshore Brightwaters Public Library. Um, I'm gonna show you how to make a cookie in a cup today. Um, I think it's a great recipe for everybody to, um, to have at home with them because we're all stuck at home. Um, we can make this in like five seconds if you're craving something and then I guess the pro to this would be that you don't have like a batch of 12 cookies to eat all at once. Um, you just have one. Um, the con would be though that this is so easy to make that you can make it whenever you want. <laughs> um, so let me show you how to make it. Um, the ingredients is just uh, flour, sugar, brown sugar, um, butter, an egg yolk, vanilla, salt, and chocolate chips. Um, okay, so first we're going to start with the butter. You can use any butter you want. Um, it's just a tablespoon. Um, have two like big regular spoons out. One you're going to use to scoop everything, the other one you're going to use to mix. Um, obviously you need a mug too. Um, any size is fine. Um, we're going to scoop the butter out. Um, just like one big scoop and just put it right into your mug. Um, you could use any butter you want. I just have dairy-free butter because it's what I use. Um, and then you're going to bring it to your microwave. And you can microwave it for like 10 to 12 seconds at a time. Um, you don't want the butter to, to start bubbling. You'll hear it start bubbling in the microwave if you microwaved it too much because um, that's going to make it too hot and then we're putting the egg yolk in soon and you don't want it to be too hot when you're putting the egg yolk in otherwise it's going to uh, start cooking the yolk which isn't a good thing okay so I did 12 seconds and that was perfect um, next we're going to do the sugars so you're going to scoop um, not with the butter spoon, you're going to scoop with your other spoon, um, one scoop of brown sugar, and you can kind of like pack it some, like with your fingers or something, um, and stick that in. And then a scoop of regular sugar. Ooh. <laughs> uh, like that, and put that in, and then put that down. And with your butter spoon, you're going to mix it all together. And then we're going to put in a pinch of salt. So literally just a little sprinkle, like that is all I have in my hand. And then like a cap full of vinegar or... Not even, like a half a cap full. Did I say vinegar? Vanilla. <laughs> um, half a cap full of vanilla. And then we're going to mix that all in. And then we're going to put in our egg yolk. And mix that in. Okay. And then we're gonna start putting the flour in. So we need about um, three spoonfuls of flour. So like that, one, two, three. So mix it all in and then let me show you what it looks like. So you don't want the consistency to be too sticky. Um, it should be like slightly dry, slightly, not a lot. Um, but you don't want it to be so sticky that it's like wet and bushy. So I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this that great, but it looks like this. Like it's not wet, it's clumpy. Um, yeah, so that, that was enough for me. And then we're going to put 
the chocolate chips in. It could be as much as you want. I kind of just eyeball it, but let me go like this. Yeah, so I do like this much. And mine are mini chocolate chips. You could do regular big ones. Now we're going to mix it all in. And then you can try after you mix the chocolate chips in, you can get like the batter off the spoon and then kind of flatten it a little bit at the bottom. So it looks like that. And then we're going to microwave it. So you can microwave it. You can microwave it from like 40 to 50 seconds. Um, when it comes out, you just want to like touch the top of it. If it still feels doughy, um, then do another like 10 seconds. You definitely don't want to over microwave it, then it'll become dry. Um, but it should be like springy. It could still feel a little wet, but if you touch it, you should feel like that springy, like baked cookie feeling. <laughs> Um, yeah, and then once this is done, I'll take it out and show you the great, uh, what I do, what I put on it is I put peanut butter once it comes out, like a scoop and then it melts on top and then put a scoop of whipped cream and eat it that way. It's delicious. <laughs> um, let me get the cookie. Okay. So mine's all done. It's nice and hot and it's it's springy it doesn't like my finger doesn't indent into it and it's hot but I'm gonna try and take a bite mm. um, that's it chocolate chip cookie in a cup I hope everyone makes it enjoy <laughs>